A man who is believed to have opened fire on an NSA building, highways, and several other locations in Washington over the past two weeks. ABC's David Curley is in Washington for us and has the very latest. Good morning, David. Morning, Robin. This all came to a head in the past couple of hours. That shooting at the country's top spy agency actually happened yesterday afternoon. It is a building on the NSA campus which sits along a highway that was apparently hit by two bullets. It was just hours earlier on that highway that shots were fired at a truck traveling down the road. Two men inside that tree trimming truck, two bullets smashed through the windshield. A bullet fragment hit one man in the shoulder, glass hit the other man. Their injuries are not life-threatening. Now, the FBI arrested a male suspect late last night and believe he is responsible for both of those shootings. And that may not be all. The FBI says it believes the man is responsible for a series of shootings between Washington and Baltimore over the past two weeks. Now, the Bureau took on this case when those shots were fired at the National Security Agency. It's a federal installation where officers collect, decode, and translate spy data from around the world. There is no word on what the alleged shooter's motive may have been. We don't even know if he was actually targeting the NSA.